Hi YouTube, this is Trudy. Uh, today I weigh 181 pounds because I just got out of surgery and so all that IV fluid and stuff has put some on me. I had my plastic surgery on Monday morning. I had to be up at 4 o'clock in the morning. Don't like mornings. And then I had to be there at 5.30. I was upstairs in the uh, pre-op area by 7. The surgery took about four, four and a half hours, a little bit longer than they expected. Uh, they gave me a new belly button, and I, I had a panicula removal. I didn't get the fancy tummy tuck like, I, uh, like some of them got. I just got the panicula removal, and for some reason I thought I would be a lot skinnier after surgery, but unfortunately uh, they only took off six and a half pounds, so to me it doesn't seem like I really lost a whole lot. I still feel like I'm still kind of big. I was hoping to be more like in a size medium, and I'm still in a large, extra large, so I'm not happy with that, but maybe once the swelling goes down I'll be back down to a medium. Um, let's see, my stay in the hospital wasn't too good. Uh, for some reason, they're extremely understaffed and don't want to hire new people. So anytime I would need help, it would take them an hour to come help me. Uh, and they wouldn't allow, well, Mike stayed the first night because they were um, taking forever to help me and he wanted to be there. And the second night they kicked him out, even though I didn't have a room late or anything, they still kicked him out of the hospital and he had to go sleep in the waiting room. And yet their care of me was still uh, not where it should be, even though they didn't have quite as many people. And that kind of sucked. Um, it took them like an hour to change my dressing. And the doctor had left the bind off my stomach so that they could come change the dressing. And it took an hour. And then that hour that it took them to come get it, I was in such pain just from not having the binder off. It was, it was pretty sad. In fact, I will be writing... A very bad review for them uh, here in the near future about how my stay was not uh, where it should be. The doctor was wonderful. Unfortunately, the nursing staff was not as well, and it, I can't blame it completely on them because they were extremely understaffed and they had a full um, bunch of people there. Um, all their rooms were full, and so. Um, it was kind of hard for them to take care of as many people as they had to with such few staff. Unfortunately, uh, that meant that I kind of got neglected any time I needed anything. They either forgot or took forever to get it, so that kind of sucked. Uh, came home, had to go uh, grocery shopping and make sure we had enough to eat for the next couple of days. So I went shopping and I was feeling fine at the time, so I didn't think it was a big deal. I wired the electronic cart. Uh, right after I have surgery anyway, so I rode that and I was okay near the end I was in a lot of pain and came home and once I took some pain pills I was fine. It really doesn't hurt as much as I thought it was going to. I was kind of dreading the whole thing but it's really not as bad as I thought so that's kind of good. Um, I will upload some snapshots that I took of my stomach and that kind of thing. Um, tomorrow maybe I'll take some new ones after I've been home so you can kind of see that the swelling has gone down a little bit and I'll kind of take them as um, we progress um, along and, and I can show you my new belly button and all that kind of good stuff so everything's doing good um, I will try to update in a couple of days since I can't really go do nothing I'm kind of stuck in bed for a while so well, thanks YouTube for listening, and I will check in again later. Talk to you later. Bye.